Verify exists to fact check the suspicious things you see online and get the truth. A viewer sent us this Facebook post, which alleges that a Catholic priest in DC was attacked by quote, Democrat backed BLM specifically because of his faith. Some on social media single out Black Lives Matter protesters and include this photo of a man with a swollen black eye. One of you emailed us saying, please verify. Several people have posted this story on Facebook in the last two days. As a DC resident, I didn't hear anything about it. Have you? And pretty quickly, we realized that there are a lot of layers to this one. So we're gonna break it down by what we know to be true, what we know to be false, and what we're still looking into. First, is this a photo of Father Thomas Hockey, a Catholic priest? Our verified researchers contacted the Archdiocese of Washington who confirmed, yes, this photo is real. A spokesperson said that Father Hockey is a visiting priest serving in the Archdiocese of Washington for a few months. He's been leading the spiritual exercises of St. Ignatius at a few parishes here. Next question, was Father Hockey actually injured? Our verified researchers obtained this police report from DC police which says yes. Father Hockey had a swollen right eye and was transported to a hospital. But was Father Hockey assaulted? And here's where we have to leave this claim in the still questioning column. According to a statement from St. Peter's Church on Capitol Hill, they say Father Hockey was assaulted, but that's not confirmed by the police report, which says that Father Hockey was walking at around 6.15 in the morning when he fell to the ground and hit his face on the sidewalk. According to the police report, Father Hockey said he woke up and his wallet and phone were missing and told officers that he didn't know how he got his injuries which means that the allegations that he was assaulted by protesters or that this was religiously motivated is just not something we could answer at this point. So if you see posts claiming that this was done by Black Lives Matter protesters, just know before you hit share that at this point, there's no evidence to support that. Police say they're gonna continue investigating the details of this case. With your Verify, I'm Evan Kozlov.